Today I'm taking part in Mai Tai in the Grip House in Glasgow. Guy started this gym in Glasgow to train women how to fight. Wow, she's amazing. This is Nicole, boxing extraordinaire <laughs> from the class. So you'd recommend ladies to come down here? Yeah, definitely. It's your gum shield. It's got skulls on it, I mean she's gonna kill. I'm now gonna get a one-on-one -on -one class with Guy. I'm gonna kick his ass. <laughs> I'm just about to drive down to the Vibe Bar in Brick Lane for a little midweek excursion of male burlesque. I'm picturing pink feathers against hairy chest. It might blow my mind. We've just heard from burlesque. Sexy. No, pretty surreal. People are way too thin. They were feeding women with cakes. We'd like to teach you all about being a bear and what you need to do to be a bear. You sit at home and watch the telly and eat. Fluffy, sweaty men. Everyone's dream. Let's go in for some more. Briefcake! <laughs> One of those guys was definitely very sexy. I am all about the beefcake. I like that a lot. It was very cynical when I arrived. Now I'm being much more open-minded. So what is the first thing you said when you saw me? Uh, you may want to change your shoes. <laughs> <laughs> I do everything in heels. Really? It's all about the looks. Isn't it? Do you want to show me how it's properly done then? Rate my um, technique and my style. Technique is actually quite really good. Technique is like 10. I didn't even pay them, I swear I didn't. The style is different. I am a fly bar rat. Bye, lads! <laughs> <laughs> I have come to Blenheim Palace in the town of Woodstock in Oxfordshire. Now Woodstock automatically makes you think of festivals, doesn't it? But does it make you think of a wakeboarding music festival? Wakestock is, is great because it's opening up wakestock and wakeboarding to a whole new group of people that may have not seen the sport before. Wakeboarding, sort of a bit like water skiing, but you do it on a snowboard. I'm going to try it out, just so you know. People have told me that it's really hard to stand up on these things. I'm definitely going to get my hair wet. But how hopefully you feel it. I'm just not thinking or feeling anything at the moment. Really? Yeah, I'm just blanking it out of my mind. Alright, cool, let's go and do it on the water. Yeah. Way more fun. Ooh. Way more fun. Rad. How's it going guys? You all set? So girls, you're probably thinking wakeboarding, yeah, it looks like fun, but it's not for me. That's why you might wake up. Having a lovely time. Bez is in the water. Myself. I just think I was better than everybody as well. Wake stock, a coupling of wakeboarding and music. I'm going to a prohibition party. I'm absolutely naked. My hair looks awful, not a stitch of makeup on. Give me some time, you shall see the transformation. I went down to one of my favourite vintage stores and got myself a flapper girl's dress with a modern twist. More of a modern day slapper. At the Prohibition 1920s party, a period in America when it was illegal to drink alcohol. Everyone used to get together in secret places. It's very exclusive, so dark and like proper secret. So we're going upstairs in this amazing mansion. Three rooms full of people, so many people dressed up. People are like gambling, playing poker, drinking gin from teacups and champagne, having a really glamorous time. And there's a silent 
The police will never know. They'll think I'm just sipping on a cup of tea with some feathers popping out of my afro. This is Margarita. Give it some. After the night of prohibition, get yourself down there to drink some gin and teacups with feathers. Mm. Oh, no, <laughs>